can we do the yoo-hoo? <laughs> right there, big release. Down. You guys are sounding awesome! There's a lot of judgment out there. What we've had from the very beginning, very special people, the gifts that they have inside, their insight, a language that no one else knows except for us. Why keep it inside? The lockdown was, uh, I didn't quite believe it was actually happening to tell you the truth when it was happening. I have a choir that I go to, the, the Kettle Choir, every week, and it's like a mainstay for me. And so that was cancelled because of the social distancing, so that felt weird. So I just ended up being at home, and uh, yeah, that was, that, it really did affect me. At the beginning, we feel um just no hope and uh, look at the internet look at uh, watch the news and then uh, my husband he's uh, sick he's uh, very vulnerable um but he had cancer but now recovery and he's like 75 years old and then uh, most of the time take care and uh, we're just uh, kind of scaring and stay home. There are a lot of people who have been, their lives have been totally disrupted through this. They've lost livelihood, they've lost their potential, they've lost their homes. There's a lot more people who will become homeless through all of this. So. Um, it's learning to, to be resilient, finding something in yourself that gives you that will to go on and, and uh, keep on trying. Loneliness, anxiety, tiredness, <laughs> depression, um, lonely, boring, <laughs> not much to do, except for practice singing and writing. <laughs> It feels great being with everyone. Happiness, relaxation. I feel calmer when with everyone. We're sort of, uh, I guess, a group that's marginalized and um, uh, not often heard, and and that's kind of what. I think the Cattle Choir was trying to get to be, was this group that um, everything came out of the choir. I was sort of not just shut in, but shut down. It was such a world catastrophe affecting everyone and um, felt very alone. I was hit pretty hard, so I mean, initially for the first few months I didn't even want to do music, I didn't want to sing. Having the weekly sessions with the Kettle Choir um, has really helped because it was sort of like an anchor. With your arms up, good, and then down and shake out your shoulders. So let's go, uh, let's do ta 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 ta. So we're gonna go ta 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 ta. And before the session, I was always excited, wait for the, in front of the screen. I'm so grateful for the, uh, our 
creative wellness. A brand new start. It's a brand new world. We don't know what to expect, but we can take a part of it and say, okay, I'm going to be here. I'm going to reach out. I'm going to make sure that my voice is heard. <laughs> I think there's a lot of loneliness out there, and especially when people are marginalized. I so miss them singing. Not That's sort of my entertainment and so this is sort of keeping me healthy because um, you know you, you get uh, depressed. Singing is a joy and uh, so uh, it's it got me through a, a, a lot of hard times is music.